Hello, the camera came on real quick and I was surprised. Welcome, Planet 2 Holistic Sports Coaching, Sports, Movies, and Other Things. Uh, okay. Last night, Chicago Bulls beat the Boston Celtics without Kevin Garnett, which is a big mind barrier for the Celtics, defending champions. One beat them last night, 121 to 118. But this is what is interesting. Seven players out of eight for the Chicago Bulls were in double digits. Now that, I have not seen that in, in moons. I haven't seen that in a long time. This is what is called team play. Congratulations. That, keep that up, any team, and you're in the money. Okay. Scholarships. Academic sports. If you're an academic, you've got to have an exercise program. It makes your studying a lot better. Circulation. The brain is a muscle. Guess what? It's in shape, and the mind is clearer. For athletes who want that scholarship, it's important to make sure, again, that uh, your mind, body, spirit, passion is also on a high level. Everything is interchanged. So parents, there are certain guarantees to get little Mary and little Johnny uh, to the colleges of their choice, considering how expensive Our it is. Our database has been updated. You hear that? I've just been updated. Always at the same time, which is extremely strange. Anyway, so team play, team play, mind, body, and spirit. So you must be able to go and just keep, just work the body. Get off the couch, get out of the chair, get off the video games and certain sites that you shouldn't be watching anyway, and go out and breathe some fresh air. How's that for excitement? Okay, movies for today. TCM tonight at 8 o'clock. A good one. Alan Ladd, Veronica Lake, 1946's The Blue Dahlia, a really good film noir, which is a dark, shadowy mystery. Interesting about Veronica Lake, for those of you who don't or aren't familiar with her, you can also, I'm sure, upload her or download her, Veronica Lake, on YouTube. She's the one who had that long hair over one eye. Interesting enough, and she was a big star in the, from about 1941 to 1945, through the end of the Second World War, she cut her hair to raise money for uh, Red Cross, military relief, bonds. After she cut her hair, her career nosedived. It shows you how fickle the movie going public is. Also recommended a new movie. I try to recommend old movies and new movies. Yesterday was Frozen River. Excellent. Small film. Please go out and watch it. It came in one fast. It's on DVD. Also out just on DVD is Doubt. D-O-U-B-T. Doubt. Meryl Streep. Uh, Seymour, Philip Seymour Hoffman. Very, very good film. Good for the mind to have a good film, isn't it? Good for you? Okay, other things today. How about a perfect spaghetti dinner? A perfect spaghetti dinner is not just spaghetti by itself or with just some sauce dumped on it. What I'm having tonight is a little spinach salad. If you don't like spinach, try bib lettuce. Try romaine lettuce. With all kinds of red pepper, yellow pepper, onion if you like it, tomato, carrots, spaghetti with, I'm uh, putting broccoli in my tomato sauce and cook it up a little bit on top of whole wheat angel hair pasta. 
a small bowl of pasta, not a big bowl of pasta because it's sugar, a starch, and you still have to burn sugar. A slice of multigrain bread with it. That's what you call a complete dinner. Families, it's wholesome and inexpensive. Well, that's it for today. I wish you uh, peace for today in your mind, body, and spirit. Take care of yourselves, be kind to yourselves, and we'll see you tomorrow. You can see me, but I can't see you. That's kind of unfair, isn't it? But life is that way. Bye.